All right, so this is part two of finding out if this video, FRP Unlock Bypass, no need for PC, it, by using this adrom.com bypass website actually works. So here I have a Samsung Galaxy A02s. This is a Samsung Galaxy A11, Samsung Galaxy A21, and an A13 5G. Let's start with the A13 5G. Uh, because it fails first and so in this video to bypass your FRP they tell you to turn on talkback so you turn on talkback by holding both volume keys vo volume buttons at the same time so let me hold vo both volume buttons at the same time talkback on. so welcome to talkback close button close button okay so Samsung setup wizard. with talkback on they want you to do this pattern but in the A13, listen to what happens. Stop. I think you can hear that. Stop. 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 So that pattern does not, so it's an immediate fail on the A13 5G. Let's go to the A21 and let me show you. Okay, so turn the, pow turn the power on. Let's turn talk back on. Hold both volume keys. Hold to, talk hold, back on. there we go. Welcome to talk. Close so, button. I'm going to close, close, close the tutorial. Samsung okay, so wizard. this pattern Welcome. right here is what they want you to do. Use voice commands to screen off. Use vo Google Assistant. Google. Open YouTube. See, this is what blows my mind. This is what's cool. Oop. <laughs> Space. YouTube, update your app. Okay, so let's go, let's bypass this, update your app. Back, navigation bar, Google Assistant. So they Tap want us, to we're going to touch here Double to open up the web browser. Google. Out of list, all. So what, what they, try again. Now open they want YouTube, you to go to, oh, let's turn off uh, talk back so we can use the keyboard. Hold it for five seconds. Talk back off. So, the website that they want you to go to is this one that you see here. This adrom.com bypass. So let's go add rom. There it is. Bypass. Go to this one. 2024. And then when you get to here, they you can clear the phone internally this way if you don't know how to uh, factory reset it here. But we've already done that. So the, the important part is the screen smart lock. And so in the video, it shows that you it allows you to set up your own screen lock and you can bypass the login. But this is the stopping point. This is the point of failure here on the A21 is that nothing hell nothing else happens here. When you get to the screen, keep your device unlocked while it's on you. Yes, I want it unlocked while it's on me. And there's no way to bypass this screen. So the A13 fails and now the A21 fails at this point. So since this one's already here, let's go to this. We've already I don't want to start a download. So we've already held the the volume buttons to open up the voice assistant and then we can give it a command to open the Google Assistant and then tell it to go to, to YouTube. Well, actually, let's just back up. and So it wants you to go to YouTube so that inside of YouTube, so let's say you get to YouTube, you're able to get all the way to YouTube by following these instructions if you're brave enough to to go and let and let me make a point here that going to this website this adrom.com bypass I don't know anything about it if it steals your data if it locks your phone if it does worse than if it downloads weird things on your phone I don't know but the process of getting into any of these uh, activation locked phones is, is pretty cool so while you can get into YouTube actually let me let's go back a little bit more show you how we got here so I've got the 
touch assistant on. Let me make sure it's on by holding the two volume keys. Talk back on. On. Welcome. Close. 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 Samsung setup so it, wizard. So it's this pattern Welcome. that we saw fail on the A13. Use voice command. Yes. Use voice command. Google Assistant. Open YouTube. Opening web Tap page. to dismiss assistant. YouTube. Task. So I'm going to hold the screen for five seconds to turn off the screen. Cause now, Talk back off. Okay, so now we're going to go to this little, and then we're going to go to settings. And then inside of settings, you go to about, and then you go to terms of service, and it opens up a browser. So this is how you get to the add ROM. Go here. Now we want to do the add ROM bypass. And now let's get to the screen smart lock. And it doesn't bring up anything. It just gives us a blank blank screen. Screen smart lock. Oh, it gave it for a second. Let me see if I can touch that. Boop, boop. I think I hit it quickly. One more time. Nope. Okay, to show you that we're really inside the phone, let's go to settings. And it brings up the settings like you normally go to and you see what this phone is. And it is, oh, there's an old SIM card in there. Uh, it's a Galaxy A11. And battery and device care. Looks like you do, you know, you can optimize it. But it's just, it, it's still locked. I mean, the, the most you can do is just use the browser. So let's try one more. Let's go over here, AO2S. All right, and let's hold the volume. Bring up TalkBack. Talk back. All right. Close. Close. To close button. Samsung. And then it's this screen. pattern. Use voice command. Use voice, Use voice command. command. Google Assistant. Open YouTube. All right, I'm gonna Double hold to two fingers for five seconds. Let's turn off the talk assistant, talk and then we're gonna go through the the go through this system. Go to about terms of service to bring up the browser. There's the browser, and we're gonna type in add rom bypass and it's this one Google bypass let's go to the smart lock let's see if it allows us to get past and here we go this is the failure point of the AO2S let's try one more time make sure that we did it right screen smart lock and nothing happens so in this video and unfortunately, all videos that try to teach you a, a factory reset protection bypass, they don't work. None of them work. I wouldn't trust any of them. If I had my real phone, these are all recycled phones. They're going to go be recycled. Uh, if I had my own phone and I had a problem with it and I, lock, I got locked out of it because I forgot my passwords, um, I wouldn't even try this because I don't know what this software does, this adrom.com bypass. So... It is a good reminder then to write down your passwords to everything. And most people you know, regularly use their, their Google or Gmail account on multiple devices so they can log into YouTube and log into Gmail, and then that's how you would log back into your phone after your factory reset it. So hope you've learned something. If you have, please like, please subscribe. Thank you for watching.